Hello again from Weber Chevrolet. I'm Nick Baycott with KC95. And with me is Mike once again from Weber Chevrolet. Good to see you. He's going to go through a few important tips on winterizing your car. So I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but we will have another winter here uh, soon. So let's go through some details. Nick, summer has been brutal on cars this year yeah. with the hundreds and, and it continued hundreds. <clears throat> We've been seeing a lot of cars coming in that low miles cars, mid 30s, something like that, where the antifreeze has kind of really suffered because it's really, really been warm. One of the cool things about the newer cars is all the fluid areas that I need to check are clearly identified, either in yellow or orange. So I got my oil dipstick tube that a guy should check when you fill up, uh, you should check the oil, if not every second time, because oil is sacrificial. As I run the engine, a little bit's used each time. We get to the point where I want to check it and see where it's at. Antifreeze is, is even getting easier than that. We have a five year, 100,000 mile Dex Cool that under normal conditions, you can go five years, 100,000 miles. Most people don't operate in normal conditions. I don't. I'm really rough on cars, short uh, trips and hauls. So the main thing is visual. It, it's translucent. We're looking for that kind of nice orangey look. If it starts to get that brown, milky looking stuff, it's time to at least check it. We have refractometers. We can determine what condition it is, how good it is. If we need a flush, we can tell you about it and we can determine if we need to go that way. When you buy a car from Weber Chevrolet, we retain your records. That's one of the kind of the neat things. We can see when things were done last time or what you need to do. And again, it's, it's kind of an easy thing to do nowadays. Windshield wiper fluid got to be number one fluid on the car. Uh, with winter coming, we can have those days where it's, you know, kind of a little misty, snowy. There's nothing worse than 3 o'clock in the morning with a windshield that won't clear. It's cheap. You can buy it anywhere. Anybody can do it. The jug is here. You just basically open it up and just pour it till your arm gets tired. If it flows out, it's not going to hurt. But there is a difference between summer blend and winter blend windshield washer fluid. It has a little more alcohol in the winter, so it won't freeze up because yeah. it gets that way. Brake fluid is one of those kind of things that's subjective. It's a translucent container so we can look in there and see because every time I step on the brake, I wear a little bit. And just like a syringe, every time I do that, I use a little bit of brake fluid. So that's why brake fluid goes down is as the pad wears, we display said fluid. Something a guy needs to check. Again, I've got some really sharp guys over here who make my job very easy. When you come in for service, all these items are looked at. We give you a checklist, tell you what's going on. We raise the vehicle. You'd be amazed uh, with all the construction that's going on in St. Louis, what we find underneath cars, <laughs> from soda cans to pieces of wood. Silly things, but they can cause you a problem. That's what these guys do. It makes my day when we find something like that because I've saved somebody some time and trouble, and I feel that we've done our job. So, again, I got some pretty sharp guys. Make my job easy. We just want you to be able to turn the key and go and have a great experience. That's our well, goal. Well, I appreciate it, Mike. Thank you very much for the great information. Very good. Winterizing your car. And with that, it is Nick Baycott for KC95 signing off until next time. We'll see you then. And once again, remember that uh, Weber Chevrolet is proving how in touch with modern technology they are by having their smartphone app. It's easier than ever to schedule an appointment no matter what needs to be done to your car at Weber Chevrolet.